We have well over 1.5 million visitors a year. We're really popular with tourists and from a Melbourneian point of view, I think people just love having an institution as unique and interesting as we are. We had an, uh, an exhibition in very recently, it's touring globally at the moment, in fact it's just gone to, to Singapore called Wonderland which is, um, it charts a kind of cinematic journey of Alice in Wonderland throughout the ages on film and it was a remarkable experience, Acme built it here. It really pushed the boundaries of what an exhibition can be in a museum environment and I took my kids and um, my daughter was just absolutely wowed by um, some of the experiences. If you are going to be great at something and improve at something, then constant learning is really important. Mark Ritson is um, a loud and engaging voice in the marketing space. I've followed his work for a while. I'm a bit of a Ritson fangirl and the combo of him and the course was attractive. Um, love the teaching, love the practical element, love the fact that we touched on theory as well as you know practical um, case study based learning. The whole experience was great, from the admin to the catering to the teaching, I really can't speak highly enough. I think the number one, which is a bit of mantra of mine for many years, but um, so good to have it reaffirmed, is market orientation. You know, you are not your audience. And that idea that the minute that you become a producer of a thing, you can no longer be an impartial consumer of it, is one that I think a lot of marketers forget. You know, the minute we get behind the, the, the fence, or you cross the Rubicon and you know too much, you, you, you can then no longer put yourself in the shoes of your audience. And therefore, you look at the data, qual and quam, you look at your customer experience, you look at your strategy and you develop um, a response accordingly um, was one of the biggest takeouts and I repeat that to my team constantly. I think marketing and brand, it's one of those interesting things. Everyone thinks that they can do it. You know, around the C-suite, it's kind of the colouring in department after the sales guy's done the, you know, this is how I've smashed my results for the quarter. And I think taking a voice of ownership around the table and really championing the importance of brand and brand strategy and then practicing that every single day. And then when you can kind of, you know, dipping into theory and applying that, that's how you do it. That's how I've tried to develop my career. And to work in an institution like this, you have to, you have to love it. You have to be a fan and you know I'm I'm a I'm a huge fan. I'm really proud of what we do here. It's a, it's it's fantastic.